IGA for telling my sister she is the reason I hardly know her kids. My sister and I have never been that close. As kids we got along fine, but she was two years older and thought she knew everything and at times it could be very annoying. As teenagers we really didn't interact all that much. In our early 20s we tried to be closer, but she was very know-it-all and also looked at me as someone who was much younger than her, instead of a sister with only a two years age gap. We had some more issues when I got married first and then when I didn't tell her about my first miscarriage she found out a couple of years later. My sister and I ended up pregnant at the same time. She was due for weeks ahead of me. Two days before she gave birth my daughter was still born. She showed up at the hospital and offered her support, but was also very insensitive. She told me to focus on the positive and that her baby was due any day and would be alive and a celebration for the family. She showed back up in my hospital room the day her oldest was born, which was three days after I lost my daughter. I asked her to please leave, but she didn't, and she told me being around my knees would help me heal. My husband had to call a nurse to get her out. I was so broken that I couldn't be happy to see my niece. For the following two months my sister was trying really hard to get me to spend time with her and her oldest and focus on them. She had three more daughters in the years that followed. I had several miscarriages in that time also. I actually never met her youngest two girls, because I ended up avoiding any family gathering she would attend. Every single time we were in the same place she would feel the need to say I could get over my own. Losses with her kids would feel the need to point out that I didn't need to be a mom because I had her girls. I asked her to stop. My husband asked her to stop. Our brother asked her to stop. She would not stop. She got more insensitive as time went on. She told me I shouldn't be capable of holding so much sadness and grief when her children were in the world. I couldn't emotionally handle it. The whole thing was too much for me. It drove me crazy. I snapped at her once and she acted like I hadn't and proceeded to let me know that her kids should be enough for me. With a lot of help, I became pregnant again at the start of this year. And my son was born not too long ago. My sister took it upon herself to show up and tell me I missed out on a decade with her kids. And how could I justify not knowing my own flesh and blood? especially when I finally got what I wanted. She called me selfish. I told her she was the reason for that, that she was insensitive and cruel always ignoring my boundaries and pushing her kids on me. When I was grieving and could not fill the void with her kids, she told me her kids are more than good enough and how dare I accuse her of being at fault. I'm the selfish one, Ada.